السلام علیکم گڈ مارننگ ہاؤ آر یو آل واٹ آر یو ڈوئنگ اسٹوڈنٹس کم بیک ٹو یور انگلش اسٹڈی ایوری ون اوپن یور میری گول ٹیکسٹ بک Okay, today in class 4, subject English, I am going to give reading practice of unit 1, wake up. Dear students, as you know, I have given reading practice of this unit of first stanza in previous video. Okay? So today in this video we will see reading of the next stanza. Okay? First of all I would like to say all the students who have given answer of my question in comment box. Thank you and very good. Keep it up beta everyone. Your answer were correct. Okay. I like, I am happy that you are involved in your study and you are giving answer okay here i would like to recap this first stanza okay then we will go further wake up wake up it's a lovely day oh please get up and come and play The birds are singing in the trees and you can hear the buzzing bees till here i have finished first stanza okay Now, you turn your pace. Let's go ahead. Dear students, come to page number 3. See this beautiful picture. Okay? Sun has already wake up. Okay? then you can see these birds are singing here you can see this is a horse okay you can see bees here also okay so let's start from second stanza wake up wake up once again here this four line will be repeat from first stanza okay students 
here the intention of giving reading practice is that few students are there who are still unable to read okay or maybe they feel difficulty in reading so students from our side we are giving our best try of reading practice okay so i hope you all were able to read so students keep finger here and everyone will read with me okay or you can first listen me and then you will read wake up wake up it's a lovely day W A K E wake U P up wake up wake up W A K E wake U P up wake up it's a lovely day I T eat apostrophe s here it's a lovely l o v e l y lovely day d a y day it's a lovely day o o h o please p l e a s e please get up g e t get u p up o please get up and come and play a and d and c o m e come a and d and p l a y play here full stop o please get up and come and play wake up wake up it's a lovely day oh please get up and come and play it's much i t e here apostrophe s it's much m u c h much it's much to t w to it's much to late l a t e late it's much too late to lie in bed t o to l i e lie it's much too late to lie in i n in bed b e d bed 
it's much too late to lie in bed here full stop so s o so hurry up h u double r y hurry u p up so hurry up here comma u y o u so hurry up u sleepy s l double e p y sleepy head h e a d head so hurry up you sleepy head okay here your second stanza finish okay wake up wake up it's a lovely day oh please get up and come and play it's much too late to lie in bed so hurry up you sleepy head okay now come to last stanza was w a s h was was means stoner and a n d and d r e double s dress was and dress means up baat le lo ready ho jao okay and a n d and come c o m e come and come on o n on and come on out o u t out was and dress and come on out everyone e v e r y o n e one every one means every person everyone is i s is everyone is up u p up everyone is a and a and the end everyone is a and about a b o u t about means every person means everyone is up and about okay you can see here this all are up and about okay the cow t h e the 
C O W cow the cow comma the horses T H E the horses H O R S E S horses the cow the horses here you can see comma then the ducks t h e the ducks d u c k s ducks the cow the horses the ducks and the sheep a n d and the t h e t and the sheep s H double E P sheep. अपने sheep तो देखा होगा, okay? Cow, horse, ducks, sheep. ये सब आपने देखा होगा, okay? So the cow, the horses, the ducks, and the sheep. These all are up and about. The tiniest chicken t h e the tiniest means very small okay so yahan pe tiniest kon hai chicken okay t i n i e s t the tiniest chicken C H I C K E N chicken the tiniest chicken chip 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 C H double E P chip ye jo स्मॉल चिकन है टाइनी चिकन है इनकी आवाज कैसे है चिप चिप सी एच डबल ई पी चिप एंड वंस अगेन हियर चिप सी एच डबल ई पी चिप द टाइनीस्ट चिकन चिप चिप Cheap. Wake up. W a k e. Wake. U p up. Wake up. Okay. So here in last stanza, it is said that you sleepy head, you sleepy person. Wake up. Wash and dress means you get ready. and come on out okay everyone is up and about who is up and about the cow the horses the ducks and the sheep this all are wake up okay and who is the tiniest the chicken is tiniest okay and which kind of noise this chicken making cheep cheap cheap okay and you can see c fletcher is the writer of this poem okay keep in mind so students let's underline the new word okay hum jo words to learn hai unko underline karte hain 
quickly. Underline here loudly. Okay. Then much and you see it much. You will underline here on much. Okay. Much ke niche aapko underline karni hai. Then two. T double O two. Okay. Underline here. Then late. L A T E late. Okay. Underline here. Then lie. L I E lie. Okay. Then bed. B E D bed. Okay. Underline this word. Next. Hurry. H U double R Y. Hurry up. U P up. So you will underline this word. Hurry up. H U double R Y. Hurry. U P up, hurry up. Then here sleepy head, sleepy head ke niche underline karo. S L double E P Y sleepy H E A D head, sleepy head. Okay. So underline here, hurry up and sleepy head. Okay. Now come here, was. W A S H was. Underline here. Then trace. D R E double S trace. Then out. O U T. Out. Underline here. Okay. O U T. Out. Now underline here on everyone. E V E R Y. Every O N E. One, every one, okay. Underline here on everyone, okay. Then up, U P up. Underline here on up. Then about A B O U. T about okay underline here then cow C O W cow then horses H O R S E S horses okay underline here Cow, then horses, okay. Then underline here on ducks, okay. Ducks ke niche underline D U C K S ducks. Now next line here, make underline here, okay. Sheep. S H double E P sheep. Next line tiniest. Okay, so you will underline here on tiniest T I N I E S T tiniest. Okay, underline here on Tiniest T I N I E S T 
tiniest then underline here chicken which word is this chicken c h i c k e n chicken okay then chip c h double e p chip okay and underline here also c fletcher okay now students let's see meaning of this word okay first one lovely what is the meaning of lovely lovely means beautiful okay beautiful means jo sundar hota hai usko hum lovely bolte hain okay then buzzing buzzing means humming sound okay ye jo b sound karti hai na usko kya bolte hain buzzing then sleepy head what is the meaning of sleepy head sleepy head means sleeping person okay means jo bahut soya rehta hai usko hum sleepy head bolte hain next tiniest what is the meaning of tiniest tiniest means very small jo chota hota hai usko hum tiniest bolte hain what is the opposite of tiniest biggest tiniest ka opposite word kya hota hai biggest okay now students here i would like to ask you question okay so my first question is who is up and about okay once again i am repeating my question question number 1 who is up and about next question question number 2 who is tiniest okay once again i am repeating my question who is tiniest sabse chhota kon hai okay and last and third question question number 3 who is the writer of the poem wake up wake up poem ka writer kon hai okay so students once again i am repeating all three questions question number 1 who is up and about question number 3 sorry question number 2 who is tiniest question number 3 who is the writer of the poem wake up okay students i will wait for your answer okay i hope you understood reading of this poem okay students inshallah in next video we will see recitation of this poem okay students keep safe at home okay keep continue your study dear students at least spend 2 hours to your study okay keep continue reading practice writing practice and you will keep yourself safe and healthy okay thank you have a nice day